Hello guys, Keith Bronson on TV here, back for yet another video. Before we get into this video, let's see if we can hit 100 likes. And if you haven't already, make sure to drop a sub. What what was that? Unbeaten in the league. Haven't conceded a goal this season. Blues turn up to Deepdale and end that run. It's finished. Preston North End, nil. Birmingham City won. We've picked up our first away win since March. Our first away win of the season. And only our second win of the season. This was a massive, massive victory for Blues because we was on a losing streak. We was in the bottom three. We didn't, you know, we don't want to um, be in a situation where we get uh, cut adrift and then we have to be relying on other teams. We're now um, out of the relegation zone. We're in twentieth place now. Brilliant, brilliant, brilliant win for Blues. I'm so happy. I am so happy. Especially after deadline day, you know, we we brought in Chong um, and uh, yeah, we followed that up with um, a big three points. So getting on getting on to um, the lineup, of course, we went with a back five again. We went with Ruddy in goal, Sanderson, Trusty and Roberts as the back three. Um, Jordan Graham played as left wing back. Colin played as right wing back. Of course, Colin was um, dropped for the uh, Norwich game Tuesday. Joshua Williams was dropped for this game. And then we had... Um, Sorry. And we had um Bakuna, Bakuna, um Bielik and Chong as the midfield three. And then we had uh, Hogan and Dini up top. Um of course this was Bielik's first game for Blues and he he started off with three points. I thought he played really well, to be honest. Uh, Bielik did. Chong, I mean Chong, was causing Preston absolute mayhem. The amount of times that he was getting fouled. Like he's his first game back for Blues, and he just looks, you know, he just adds that e that something extra to this team, doesn't he? With all his trickery and, uh, you know, opens the play up, so on and so forth. So, um, the first half, it was, I think it was pretty much all Blues. Preston did have a shot, which was comfortably saved by John Ruddy. Um, but we took the lead, we took the lead, and it was um, the wing backs, um, Jordan Graham and Maxim Collin. Um, Combining for this goal, combining for this goal, yeah, that's how you say it. Um, so Jordan Graham with brilliant ball into the box. Maxine Collins there at the back stick with a header. Reminds me of that Sheffield United goal he scored um, at the first day of the season. Uh, last season, of course, different type of goal, but still with his head. And uh, yeah, Maxine Collins is, uh, is a, you know, he's, he scores a few good goals for us, doesn't he? And I've always said that Jordan Graham is actually our best crosser of the ball. So it finishes 1-0, and then in the second half, Preston, was it a penalty? Troy Powett was Troy Powett was um, pulled back by Sanderson. That looked like a penalty to me, and uh, Preston had a goal disallowed. Um, we took Chong off, we made some substitutions in like the 60th minute, took Chong off, uh, brought Jordan James on. I thought that was a bit questionable. I know Chong hasn't played in a long time, um, but, uh, you know... Look what happened against Norwich. We took off our best attacking players and then, uh, yeah, it fell apart. But this time, this time, we held out. And I always thought this was going to be a really tight game. I went with 1-0 Preston. So I thought it was only going to be like one goal, maybe even two goals in this game. But yeah, um, I'm so delighted that we've actually picked up an away win because, of course, um, that's been uh, our trouble, hasn't it? Um, we used to be decent on the road under the likes of Gary Monk. Um, but... The last couple of years, that's not been the case. And, um, you know, it's important if we want to stay in this league to hopefully now this can actually make us build, moment uh, build momentum. Swansea at home next Saturday at St Andrews. I think that's a winnable game for us. Um, and that new left back, by the way, he didn't start. It's going to be interesting to see if he actually sticks with this back five. when Because I think Jordan Graham, I think he should start, you know. Hannibal Avery, of course, was on the bench for this game. He came on for like the last couple of minutes to, um, yeah... Um, Wind the clock down. But yeah, it's finished. Preston North End nil, Birmingham City 1. Brilliant, brilliant win. Oh yeah, by the way, in the second half, yeah. Um, when that tactical substitution happened, uh, well, I don't know if it was a tactical. I don't know why the hell Chung came off. Um, Jordan James, come on. Preston were coming on to us more because they wasn't scared. You know, we wasn't that much of a threat attacking-wise because we had our best attacking player off the pitch. Jordan James, come on. And uh, Ruddy, by the way, John Ruddy, just a quick shout out to John Ruddy. He's been absolutely exceptional, hasn't he, for Blues? He's arguably doing better than Neil Leverage. 
Anyway, like I said, let's see if you couldn't want to like it's been keep on time TV, make sure to like, share and also subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching guys. Big three points, keep on time.